All right, Sean, we just hit our last stop on the way home. What's your uh, what's your final synopsis here today? Well, Luling City Market was pretty good. Uh, I would have to say, you know, everything there was excellent, well done. Um, overall, this has been pretty interesting to kind of sample little bits and pieces of uh, all the stuff here in the Hill Country, or in Central Texas, I should say Hill Country. But uh, if I had to give me my top three, though, I'd have to say Snows. I know we started out there first thing, but their brisket just so tender it fell apart it was it was really really good uh i'd put luling city market second i thought everything that we had was very good beef i mean the pork rib was outstanding the sausage wasn't very greasy it was very good ranked up there with south side um number three i'd have to say smitty's despite the sausage uh, the brisket was excellent the shoulder clod was excellent so I would, those would be my top three overall um, I'm gonna have to say for me number one is, uh, is snows. That, uh, the the brisket was the best brisket I have ever eaten in my entire life. It was just phenomenal. Loved it. It came apart uh, just perfectly. It was moist. It was no words for it. It was, it was fabulous. The the pork there was also just absolutely excellent too. So so snows is my number one. Uh, number two I think has to be. City Market here in Luling where we just finished up. It was the last one of the day, but um, it was all around really good. The brisket was, was was fantastic. The sausage was very good. It was very well done. Um, I think it's probably the second uh, number two to, to Elgin or Southside in Elgin, but uh, but it was still very good. And the uh, the ribs were uh, fabulous too. So uh, so number two there. Number three is going to be Smitty's. Um, the the, was, the brisket was just excellent there. Um, very well done. They really let the meat do the talking for it. You know, they, it wasn't over seasoned. It was just really very well done, and the uh, the, the, the beef cloth there was just really phenomenal. I think that was a standout there. So snows, city market, and uh, and Smitty's. Man, what a long day! I didn't think I was going to be able to taste the barbecue restaurants at the very end as good as I could taste them at the very beginning. I figured after eight or nine of these restaurants, my taste buds would be worn out. Uh, some of the ones that we had at the very end were better than some of the ones we had at the very beginning. I was really surprised by that. Uh, if I had to name top three, number one, Snows. The brisket was absolutely the best brisket I've ever had in my entire life. I would drive that far again just to get that brisket. Number two, number three, it's really difficult. I've been switching back and forth between them a couple times. I think um, number two for me now is going to be uh, City Market in Luling. Uh, everything they did was really good from the brisket to the ribs. The uh, sausage wasn't bad. It was it was one of the better sausages we had. Um, uh, you know, it wasn't up to you know Elgin standards, but uh, Southside Market uh, in Elgin standards. But it was still darn good. Uh, ribs were fantastic. Uh, I would put City Market and Luling as number two. Number three, I've been going back and forth between Smitty's and uh, Louis Miller's in uh, Taylor. I you know I'm not sure the ambiance at Louis Miller's was better. Um, I think the brisket at Smitty's has a little bit of an edge, so uh, I, I guess I'm going to have to go Smitty's even though uh, that sausage was just disgusting. So uh, there's my top three, Snow's, uh, City Market, and Smitty's is number three. Uh, I'm much less full than I thought I would be, first of all. Um, I could probably continue eating if I had to. I'm glad that we're not going to continue eating, but if I had to, uh, I thought by this point of the trip I would be so gone, uh, so full that nothing would taste good, but we actually ended on a very high note, a couple of high notes actually, and uh, you know, it was fantastic, it was a blast. Uh, some of these places I hadn't been to in 15 years, so it was great to go to them again. Uh, some of them I had been to recently, so uh, it was it was great, it was fantastic. What do you, uh, I know you're a sausage person, so give me your best place for the sauce for sausage. Yeah, my, my favorite place, actually overall, just, uh, just you know, not just sausage, but Southside Market in Elgin. Uh, it's my favorite place for sausage, and the sausage there is so good that it just, that was by far my favorite meal of the day. Um, nobody does sausage like Elgin, and especially Southside, and so... That was just fantastic. I could not, I couldn't stop eating there. That was actually where I ate the most. Uh, my second favorite place would be Snow's. Um, the brisket, I'm a lean brisket guy, but the brisket there was moist without being overly moist and fatty. And so it was a perfect combination. And, you know, 
I I don't eat much brisket anymore. Uh, I did today as a gave up red meat about a year and a half ago, but uh, kind of broke that today. Can't go on a barbecue trip and not have brisket. So um, you know, if I ate brisket, I would definitely be up. You know, if you're for a special event or something, I'd completely find it acceptable to drive the two hours to get Snow's brisket. And then my third favorite place, I'm going to cop out and do a tie. Um, City Market in Luling was very good. The sausage was actually pretty damn close to Southside in Elgin. Um, and the brisket was actually very lean, but not dry. So that was a, a great combination. And the beans were pretty tasty there too. And then uh, it tie with Louis Miller. Um, you know, the brisket there was very good. The ambiance there though, just screams Texas barbecue. And uh, out of all the places today, if I had visitors coming into town and they wanted barbecue, I would say, well, let's make the drive up to Taylor. Out of the nine stops we made, I think Louis Miller just, the ambiance alone almost seals the deal and the food is really delicious.